walked up to him one day, I said, hey man, I get this idea for a story called Connor the Cutter, because I have a son named Connor. And, and Rod's like, dude, I have a son named Connor. I was like, wow, I guess this is meant to be. So we, uh, we shook hands, went to Panera Bread. And so we sat down with our laptops and the, the kids were, the family was all with us and we're, um, as we're writing, we're just outlining all these ideas on this napkin. It was kind of a miracle. By the end of that, that two hours, we already had book one completely outlined and, and plotted out and ready to go. And a week later, we had the first draft written. Rod's in the Navy and I'm in the Coast Guard and, and you know, in the Coast Guard, our core values are uh, honor, respect, devotion to duty. And uh, we hope that these books you know, help the younger generation you know, through these children's stories and then maybe that will carry them through, um, through the adolescent years and then adult years. If someone comes to me with an idea, my first answer is you can, period. We just wanted to teach kids awesome messages, and next thing you know, you've got just random people come up to you thanking you for writing a story that touched their soul. So it goes back, you know, a children's book that's written just for children, uh, it's not, not very good. <laughs> I mean, that's, that's our why. That's our why. That's why we do it, to inspire, to bring hope. For every life lesson that we've learned the hard way, we're going to teach it to kids the easy way. So that's what we're here for. Yeah.